Bees are some of the most important species on the planet. Without bees, we would probably not survive. However, are we actually saving the wrong bees? You've probably heard the phrase save the honeybee or save the bees. While honeybees are very important in the pollination of crops, they are actually nowhere near the brink of, of extinction, but many other native North American bees are. Honeybees pollinate over $15 billion worth of crops in the United States each year, including 130 different types of nuts, fruits, and vegetables. That ends up to become over one third of the world's food honeybees pollinate, and some estimate that the number of honeybees and their colonies and hives are actually increasing. Globally, also, honeybees have increased by around 30% since the year 2000. Honeybees are also managed by thousands of farms that produce honey. When we pull our intentions to save the honeybee, there are many other bees that are actually at the risk of going extinct. For example, there are four North American bees that are actually at the risk of going extinct. These four bees are all bumblebees. The Rusty Patch Bumblebee, the American Bumblebee, the Franklin Bumblebee, and the Southern Plains Bumblebee. Since the year 2000, the population has dropped to a staggering 90%. This is happening because of the widespread use of pesticides, habitat loss, and climate change. These bees also highly contribute to the widespread pollination. Without many of these bees, many native plants can end up suffering. Because of all the attention focused on the honeybees, it is overshadowing the wild bees' importance. The phrase, save the bees, started around the year 2006, when many beekeepers started reporting that they have sustained big losses of honeybee colonies. Because the business of beekeeping was under threat, calls to save the bees circulated, but ever since then, the amount of honeybee colonies and farms across the United States have extraordinarily increased. Some estimate there are more honeybees at this exact moment than any other point in the history of the United States. While it's important to respect and value the honeybees, we need to respect many other native bee species that are soon to be extinct. If you would like to help out, the best thing you can do is plant a pollinator garden in your yard next spring or summer. I have my own pollinator garden video, so please make sure you go check it out. I hope everybody enjoyed this video, and thank you all so much for watching.